Hello, I'm Gav. I'm Dan. We're the Slow Mo Guys. This video is about blanks. Blanks are used instead of real bullets when you want to do things like movies or military exercises. You get the flash and the bang yeah. without the bullet. Essentially everything except the bullet, that's right. Yeah. So instead of a bullet, it's got like a crimped end and some propellant in there. But the propellant still has to come out. Yeah. And still does damage. It still has to be compressed by being in here so it has a bang rather than just going Pfft. I actually have never used one. You've never used one before? No. I was going to say, you've been blanked, but you've never used one. <laughs> OK, well, this is a, a real sort of 9mm ball round. Yes. And here's our unspent blank, and this is our spent. So basically, instead of a load of gunpowder being behind the bullet, it's, there's no bullet, and then it just crimps the end. It's essentially the same, except without a projectile. But it will still deafen you. It will still literally wound you with the stuff that comes out. Yeah, absolutely, 100%. All right, well, let's put that to the test. OK, today we're using the Phantom TMX 7510. We'll start at 82,000 frames a second. And the first target is an egg. Wow! <laughs> it's like egg disposal ammo. It doesn't have the, like, oomph of a regular round. It's just sort of like a little pop. But it smashed the egg. Blimey. Yeah, so it doesn't have any gas pressure to force the slider back to, to load it, the Because it needs round. to compress the gas against the back of the bullet. But there's no bullet, so it's just... <laughs> yeah, and it basically, yeah, exactly. Um, so it can't cycle to the next round unless you put what's called a BFA in, which is a blank firing attachment, which they use a lot of the time in films and in the military. The ones in the military that I was using had, like, they're a big yellow thing on the front. Yeah. Ready. Oh! <laughs> Oh, look at all the gunk that comes out of there. So I can't tell whether it's just the air or whether it's the, the fragments that create the egg. Well, look, you spark. You can see, yeah, there's like little sparks on the egg, which then busts it open. Yeah, look, it's, it's now just being blown away. <laughs> look, there's little bits of it still going into the yolk and stuff. You wouldn't want to be that egg, would you? There's loads of it. You would not. OK, let's do it again, but I'll be at like 45 degree angle. Here we go. Oh, that seemed beefier somehow. That was really loud, didn't it? Yeah. Take note here of the fact that this regular speed camera, which is 50 frames a second, didn't see a single frame of any muzzle flash. Whoa. It was what? absolutely pebble dashed. Oh. It was peppered. That was a really like fiery one there. That was crazy how much like flames come out and all the bits. That was really fiery. Look at all the sparks, like each piece. Each individual bit cracks <laughs> the egg. It's like it's like a mini shotgun. You see that? Yeah. It's like tiny bird shot. Yeah. It's like ant shot. Ant shot, yeah. And then it breaks the egg in like a thousand different places and then all the gas pressure just blows it away. It's not like high velocity spatter, but it still wrecks the egg entirely. Oh, it annihilates it. The bullet always went in and ejected tiny little pieces of shell. But that one, it's just like taking a shotgun to it and then going <laughs> <laughs> really hard. OK, next target, slightly meatier. Mm -hmm. Meat. <laughs> was it just a bit of ham? <laughs> it's a little bit of a ham, yeah. <laughs> that is a weird sight, I'll be honest. In it's the middle a... of a quarry. <laughs> it's pretty windy, the ham's flapping around. Well, the ham knows what's coming for it. <laughs> Made ready. You ready? Ready. Oh my god! That just went! I was expecting a few holes in the ham. Yeah, same. I'm almost as blown away as that ham was. <laughs> <laughs> Flip. Oh, here's a bit, look. <laughs> god. Okay, that is serious. That's really far. It is really far. Oh, god. <laughs> that. Oh. Whoa just rips it apart in the center there. You can Absolutely see. Absolutely just murks the middle of that ham. Just the whole of it. Oh, that is gruesome. That is, that's, I don't, can we show this? I don't know, it might, it might be like your uvula and get demonetized. Oh. Yeah, because there's no projectile, it just, it like made the ham the projectile. That's unreal. It just tore it a new one. <laughs> <laughs> it literally did. Let's get that from the other side. Okay. <laughs> Why do you guys not upload more? Well, it's, it's, the ham was flapping around. <laughs> what <Bloody> hell? <laughs> do you see what I had to do there? I had to like wrangle the ham. <laughs> that was a mid-shot ham wrangle. <laughs> that 
honestly, there's tiny little flecks of ham everywhere. It definitely needs a ambulance. Okay. Well. <laughs> <laughs> this video, I can already tell this video is going to be crap. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god. Oh. That is nasty. It like creates a ripple as well, and it just rips it. Each tiny little fleck of powder, I guess, has enough force to just go straight through the ham, like it weighs something. It doesn't weigh anything. It just disintegrates the it middle part. It just mists the ham. It's not gruesome footage, but it just makes you imagine, like, what, what could happen. If you are made of is, ham, and, yeah, if you this made would ham. be, yeah. Uh, should we try a water balloon? What's that, about three feet away? Yeah. Let's see if we lose the balloon from this distance. I have a feeling we will. Okay. Make him ready. Are you ready? Ready. Oh. Yeah, we did. Wow. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty surprised by the range. I wonder if we'll see less of the like pushing air force on it. Oh, you can see the blurred bit. You can see the shot. Yeah. Pong, 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 pong. So it seems like a lot of it actually wasn't powerful enough to go through. You can see it just bouncing off. Yeah. But there was one bit up here that was, I guess, slightly bigger or going faster that went through the balloon and caused the rip. Interesting. So I'd say that's at the very edge of the... Oh, look, you can see the splash marks where the other bits hit. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely the edge, like you say, of the, of the sort of effective range of a blank round. I, would, I certainly wouldn't want to stand in front three feet away from it. Absolutely not. Beauty. It's a beauty, mate. Oh! <laughs> oh! Did that just come back at you somehow? Yeah, that one was more of a... Uh, I feel like that one was more of a beefy round. Like it was... Did you hear it? It was like a real... Yeah, that was a... That was a Heftonzite. Maybe these aren't the most consistent. Yeah, that was an OP one. Look at the oh, heat wave. God. Wow. Oh my... That was a serious one. That was... I am not exposed for the brightness flip. of that light. That's a cool moment though. I'm almost getting like a Schlieren effect with the sun pointing out the, it, the shockwave as well as the expanding gas. About a hundred different scars on the balloon and then it's just blown out from the fireball hits it as well. <laughs> That's ridiculous. That was an absolute monster one. I think we've proven the point. I think and so. And got some quite nice slash gory looking footage. Well, that was carnage. And I was expecting carnage, about this much. Yeah. This is the carnage we filmed. Gruesome. <laughs> Are you specifically referring to the ham? Because, I'm yeah. thinking of the ham. I haven't stopped thinking about the ham until I saved it. <laughs> I think I'll eat some now. <laughs> it just does go to show how dangerous these can be. And they're not yeah. to be taken lightly, you know? Yeah, don't, um, don't fool around with yeah. a blank. Mm -hmm. But also not with a bullet either. So I think everyone knew that already. It's not, it's not a PSA. We're here just... for your information, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I've yeah, I... learned a lot. I just think it was nice to visualise it. I've, uh, I've never seen one up close no. or in slow-mo. No, I didn't really, for the longest time, years ago, know what a blank really was. And yeah, I me neither. Yeah. Well, hopefully you enjoyed that video. Make sure you subscribe if you're into slow-mo. Here's a nice other video for you to watch. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. B, so he's blanked me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>